Hey everybody, this is Jack Rainmaker from Flipping Las Vegas, and today is another great and sunny day. Look at this. I mean, you can't see anything because the light's too bright, obviously. But anyway, uh, I'm going to talk to you today about something that I know that a lot of us in business find to be very frustrating, and this is dealing with individuals who don't say or who don't do what they say they're going to do who don't follow up, okay, it represents a business opportunity for you and I, okay, but it also hurts them. So let me tell you the story. I'm going through the MLS. This is last Monday. Today is Friday. And my system comes up with some undervalued properties. They're townhouses off the strip. Phenomenal. I look further into it discover that the owner of these townhouses is actually a realtor, broker, who owns them. And there are nine units total that he's selling. So, of course, I do what I normally do. I pick up the phone. I call him. I say, hey, this is who I am, Jack Rainmaker, Mr. Checkbook. We're one of the largest cash buyers here in Las Vegas. And I have a whole bunch of investors that are constantly buying real estate and I'm the sharp end of the stick, okay? I find the stuff that they're looking for. And I have a buyer for his properties. I have actually more than one buyer or potential buyer who can close cash in seven days. So this guy proceeds to tell me, hey, listen, I've got nine properties for sale, but I also have and know the owners of other units that want me to list their properties. And I myself have three other houses that I want to sell. The reason I'm liquidating right now is because there's another investment I'm making, which is pretty substantial. And so I need to liquidate everything I have now to be able to make this investment. I said, great, we can help each other. Right? Okay, real simple. So I told him, listen, I'm going to go ahead and make an offer on one of the units. Okay, in the email. We'll talk about putting together a package deal, so on and so forth. Get back to me, okay? Tell me what you have, and let's go from there. So I send him my offer. This is Monday. Tick-tock, 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 tick-tock. Tuesday morning, he sends me an email, says, listen, I'm really super-duper busy with stuff today, so I'm not going to get to your offer this morning but I will later. Okay. Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Thursday, I call him, pick up the phone and call him, right? It's not call him and then pick up the phone. <laughs> anyway, so I pick up the phone and call him and say, hey, this is Tuesday morning. What's going on? By the way, you didn't put the building numbers on there. We went and took a look. Um, we couldn't find any units because there's like a bazillion trillion buildings up there. So it's almost impossible. I don't, building numbering in Las Vegas still gets me. I don't get it. But anyway, so you didn't put the building numbers on there. So we couldn't really see the outside of the units. By the way, they're all rented out, which is phenomenal. Okay. So I say to him, where are we? What are we doing? And he says, well, I got another unit I'm about to list. I actually have two more units that I'm about to list. And I said to him, what are the addresses? What do they want for them? I'll buy them. I mean, how hard is that, right? Okay. And then he tells me I have three other houses, one on this street, and then two out in the Northwest. And they both have tenants, and I want to sell them as well. I said, fantastic. Send me an email with everything you have. He says to me, I'm going to go downstairs right now to my wife's computer and put everything together and email it to you. Tick-tock, tick-tock, tick-tock. Here I am Friday morning at 1030. Nothing's going on. What the fuck? Okay. This guy has probably, just on the townhouses alone, about $800,000 worth of assets he's trying to sell. Right? Okay. Figure the three houses. Average price. What do you say? I'm guessing because he hasn't given me anything yet. Okay, average price, let's say 230,000. So you get another 700,000, 690,000, whatever, in assets to sell there. So total assets for sale? Come on, what the fuck? Okay, so do me a favor. 
if you're fucking selling something, okay, and you advertise that you're selling something, pick up the phone and answer, number one, okay? Number two, do what you say you're going to do. I'm sure a lot of you are saying, oh, we're, oh, I, wow, we, what was me? I wish I got more money for that. Well, yeah, you'd get more fucking money if you answered the phone. You would get more money if you did what you say you're going to do. Now, will I get this deal? Absolutely, because I never give up. Anybody who knows me knows I never give up. I'm going to close this guy. I'm going to buy all of his deals, okay? And because of the extra effort, he's going to have to give me a bigger discount. This is Jack Rainmaker, Flipping Las Vegas. Listen to these words.